In this installment of the VIP Test Modeler 101 training series, we're going to be going through creating your first workspace inside Test Modeler. By the end of this session, you will have a VIP Test Modeler workspace that you can use to create models. If your organization already has a domain, please contact your system administrator to request your workspace and a username and password. So what is a workspace? Well, a workspace is used to create a work area for your organization within Test Modeler. The nice thing about a workspace is it has its own URL, which is an extension of the cloud portal. A workspace is private and isolated from other workspaces and other organizations. All assets, be that models, tests, or recordings, are stored in the workspace and can only be accessed by users who have rights to access to that workspace. There's also full administrative capabilities to invite, add and remove users and assign specific roles. So let's get into Test Modeler and create our first workspace. After completing the sign up for Test Modeler, it took us to the workspace page where we can create a new workspace. Now, to create a workspace, it's pretty simple. We just need to enter this input box here and specify a workspace name. Now, this name should be something that resonates with you or your organization. Usually, the organization's name is used for the workspace. Here, we're going to call the workspace Training 101, and I'm going to click Create. What you'll see here is that we've taken through to the Training 101 workspace that's been created as an extension of the cloud-based portal URL. And we'll see we're now inside Test Modeler, our web-based modeling engine. If we sign out of Test Modeler here, and let's sign back into our account, what we'll see is that every time we sign into Test Modeler, we're presented with the ability to enter a workspace or create a new workspace. A user can be a member of many workspaces at any time. To enter any of these workspaces, select the workspace drop down here, specify the workspace you want to enter, and then navigate in, which will take you to your selected workspace. Thanks for watching this video. Any questions, please email james.walker at curiosity.software.